Hello to my wonderful subjects. This is the Lunchbox Podcast, a podcast where high schoolers who lack knowledge, experience, and sunlight use self-deprecating humor to vent their low self-esteem issues. I am today's host, the Kaiser's Wombat. I am joined today by Blue. Hello. Incognito. Oh, incognito. Uh, sorry, oh, dude. Uh, what up, y'all? <laughs> this is like a great start. Hello, can you hear me? Yes. Yes. Uh, uh, yeah, what up? Riven. Hi. <laughs> and Sir Kupatua. Hello. And they will be our regular members. Now, uh, since we're going to be the regular members, and we're going to be doing this for a long time, I hope, right? Hopefully. Uh, or it's going to end after this episode. Hopefully not. Um, I think we should get to know each other a little bit better and also let the audience know a little bit about ourselves. So, uh, I think the best way to do that is would you rathers. Oh, okay. Indeed. Okay, so Wonderful. the first That's one. what I was thinking, too. Okay, the first one, right? Wait, Would you wait. rather be punched in the face with brass knuckles by Mike Tyson or punch a toddler and be seen by thousands of people? I just have a question. Do we have to state our reason? Yes. Oh, yes. And punch a uh, there's, a, there's a note. Mike Tyson would be in his prime. You would have to punch a toddler with full strength and none of the victims would die. Toddler. Okay. Punch a toddler, because I don't think I'd have enough strength to actually, like, cause serious damage to a toddler. No, but people will be looking at you and, you know... It doesn't matter, because Mike Tyson can seriously hurt me with brass (laughs) knuckles on. Like, he could seriously, like, break my nose. I don't think I can break a toddler's nose with a punch. Okay, I Oh, you'd be surprised, but... Um, I'd rather take a hit from Uh Mike Tyson, because... Me compared to him, I would look like the toddler being hit by him. <laughs> <laughs> but then, but then, Mike, when you punch by Mike, Mike, Mike won't it? Yeah, you don't have to be. Yeah. You won't be able. No, to, uh, it, it doesn't, doesn't say that. that it doesn't say that someone people. will see you. So maybe no one will yeah, see you yeah. being beat up. Yeah. Oh my god! But you have like facial scars for the rest of your life because your face was like crushed. And have you seen a picture of Mike Tyson? Okay, <laughs> I know who he is. This guy I... is ripped. He's like. <laughs> Uh, I would punch a toddler because I don't want to get hurt. Uh, okay, I, uh, I, you know, I'd, I'd probably be... punch a to- toddler because okay. I don't want to be in a coma. Uh, my my answers are gonna be so cheap, but it's it's the way I am. So I'm gonna do, I'm gonna choose punch a toddler and be seen by thousands of people. But it's gonna be like a type of punch that's so soft. No, 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 no you no, can't no, do that. It said, it said you have you to be have at full to punch strength. A toddler with full strength. Oh shoot. <laughs> I'm gonna punch with full strength, but right after I'm gonna hug the toddler. No. <laughs> and then you're gonna crush the rest of its bones. I'm sorry. I- I'll say sorry, and I'll tell him to punch me back as hard as he can. Or you're just wow. gonna shake him to death. Social experiment, guys. Don't. Worry. Social experiment: punching a baby. Okay. Next one. Okay. Next hug, one. I'll hug him right after. Okay. Next. Nah, one. that's a boring one. Just or a hug. Yeah, a boring one. Okay. Only be able to whisper or only be able to shout. Shout because um, that's all I do already. Um, because I'm in this podcast, I would only be uh, only be able to shout is what I would choose. Because there's no way anyone can hear me if I was whispering. Try whispering. Anyone else? Wait, try whispering. Shout. Try, try whispering. Because... I, I'd, sh- I'd shout, yeah. I'd yeah. shout. Only 29%... Of people who shout. take this would rather agree with us. Uh, they're, they're, I don't they're, want they're to sound like I'm whispering all the time. ASMR, <laughs> ASMR. I will try whispering. I will let it sound all the time. Should, should we go on to the next one? Um, yeah, we should probably go on to the next sure. one. Yeah. Oh, God. Would you rather eat 300 donuts in four hours for $500? Or, or drink a cup of sour milk for $50? You enter donuts in four hours because four hours is 240 minutes. So that gives me around um, half a like 30 seconds to eat one donut. It's not that not that hard. I mean, you get to eat donuts to get $500. That's a dream come true. 
Well, yeah, you're not I'll necessarily going to finish. Shut up. Like, so what shut was, up. Wait, 300, wait, 300 donuts in how many hours? Four. Yeah. Four hours. Or what's the other one? A cup Drink of sour milk. milk. Fifty dollars. A cup of sour milk. Fifty dollars. <laughs> cup of... Like spoiled milk. Oh, wait, no. So what's, what's, the, what's, what's, what's the effect of it? Okay, so if you eat the donuts, you get five hundred dollars. If you drink the sour milk, you get fifty dollars. Oh, how about you, Riven? I don't think you, I Riven? could eat three hundred donuts, though. Um, like I, 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 I would rather drink the sour milk because I don't think I could drink. I, I don't think I could eat three hundred donuts in four hours. Okay, so which one is the group consensus going to be? Donuts. 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 donuts okay. Yes. Next one, please. Donuts. I was so lost that entire conversation. I have Don't no worry. idea what you are doing. I know. Oh, we're with the majority. Yay! <laughs> of course, us. it's the power of donuts. Wait, 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 wait. Well, guys, what, what if you guys are not able to finish all the donuts then? I don't so you know. You don't give $500. No. That's all. But exactly. You, you still get to eat donuts. You still get to eat donuts for free. <laughs> I don't see anything wrong it's with that. Win-win situation. Ooh. No? Um, okay, thank would you. Would you rather burn to death no, or uh, drown? Drown all the way. Cause, 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 cause I, I, I heard that like, like after the suffering point, there's like a peaceful state of when you drown. I mean, I mean, that's what people think. That's what How people think. How would anyone know? Has anyone ever come back from drowning? No, I said that's what people think. <laughs> I don't know, great. but I've if you heard what I said, okay. I'd rather. I've drown. almost drowned. It's terrifying. Let me just. It's, it's absolutely terrifying. But the, you're not going to be able to breathe either way. That's the thing. Burning to death would be a lot. E- would be a lot quicker death. Yeah, so I'd probably go with uh, the the. Wait, fabric. wait. I just want to. I just want to hear Riven's story. <laughs> no, no, we have oh. to keep the story. No stories until story time. No, 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 no. This Tell is, a story. This, this is a good story. Okay. Okay, I just wanted. To so, um, you know those little floaty boards, right? They're kind of like little surfboards that you use when you're. Oh yeah. Um, yeah. You're practicing how to Beat swim. The bottom. Yeah. Beat the bottom. That's what they. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So I was at a pool, right, with the um. It was at a party or something. Mm-hmm. And there was this really nice kickboard kind of thing that my sister really liked. Uh-huh. Um, and me being me, I decided to steal it from her. Wow, such so a nice brother. I take it and I swim to the deep side of the pool. Mm-hmm. And so she can't follow me. Uh-huh. But she decides to jump after me. <laughs> um, yeah. Um... <laughs> She starts, yeah, to down, a... she starts to go down. She starts to go down under, uh-huh. and so, in the process, I panic and I try and get there. <coughs> and this is why Riven floaty, only has the, a the floaty. Yeah, the floaty thing goes away, and we're both there under. And so I try and get over there to help, but then she kicks my head underwater. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> and I'm struggling under there underwater in the deep end and every time i try and get up she keeps kicking me under under the underwater over and over and over again uh-huh. and each time my air was just <laughs> keep getting kicked out of my, out of my lungs <laughs> why, 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 why was she kicking you because she was just... struggling to get up for air as well oh wait where you go where, where you going? but the thing is she's... yeah she was like, how's this funny how is this funny she was no. <laughs> Oh, it's Mr. Blue here. But it's, just, it's sort of comical, you know, how she yeah. keeps kicking him underwater. Yeah, yeah that's funny. Um, I, I don't know. <laughs> Sad. Oh, okay. Sad. Just sad. Um, okay. Okay, but um, she was over the... She was perfectly fine breathing up there. But I was down there drowning. Thankfully, some guy saw us and some some random stranger and he just dived straight into the pool and helped me wait wait but, so you were you were at a party pool and then there's some random stranger in the party pool yes what because <laughs> when you okay. travel a lot you go to parties and um events where you don't really know oh, okay, you know okay, like okay. only about 10 percent of people there's this random fat guy i don't know he, he saved my life i think oh no well, now that we're done with this, should we go to the next one? No, wait. I don't want to drown. Okay. That's it. Okay. Should we go to the next one now? Uh, okay. Yeah. Uh, not this one. Not this one. No, 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 no. no, no. If yes. you had a machete, if you had a machete, would you rather amputate the feet of two friends 
or amputate one of your own feet. Question, is it both of their feet or just one of each of your friend's feet? I it's think it says feet, so... Probably hey, both. take a look at that, that comment right there. They don't have to be close friends. Well, that's true. That, that, hmm. But then that will apply to all of us, to each other. Well, it depends on, like... Yeah, like, a friend quote unquote friend. Like, oh, well, in that case, I'll, I'll, I'll go for the former. Oh, yeah, I think I'll go for yeah. the two, uh, two friends. Thank you, random comment. Yeah, thank you for, thanks for not, you know. Josh Francisco. Friend, fr- friend, friend, they could be, they could, they could be know, the hard. fake friend, you know, because they're still friends. Though, yeah, that's what we fake. just established right now. Yeah. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so... Oh, 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 oh. Now you now we see how the how society truly is. Yeah, this this is tagged under pain and suffering. <laughs> this is wonderful. Yeah. Would you rather? Let me let me get a good one. Okay. Wait. Wait. Okay, waiting. Okay, Just would there. you rather work recycling human poop for the rest of your life? Or work with dangerous and explosive chemicals for the rest of your life. Dangerous and explosive chemicals. Dangerous and explosive chemicals. If I die, it's gonna be it's gonna be fast. And also, uh, uh, okay, okay. If it, I, I want to say, I, I would say working with dangerous and explosive chemicals because if you die and your job is working with human poop, it's so lame. It sounds so lame. <laughs> <laughs> you but die you know, because like, of poop. You know, people actually do apparently, like in a farm or something. Yeah, shocking, isn't but it? But working with dangerous explosives, you, you die like a heroic way. Like, you, you saved everyone's life. Okay, by... wait, 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 wait. I don't think that's going to be heroic necessarily. I mean, I mean, I mean guys, guys, at guys, least, guys, like, guys. a teeny-weeny bit. <laughs> teeny-weeny. Guys, guys, what? The, com- the thing underneath it says you wouldn't have to touch the poop all the time, and the chemicals are known for taking off entire limbs frequently. Yeah, that's what the... Um... That's what the little note from the person who made this says, is that you wouldn't have to touch the poop all the time. But the chemicals are known for taking off entire limbs frequently. I feel like this person wants us to click on a certain answer. Yeah. Do you want yeah. to go against the norm and click on the dangerous? I want to work with dangerous and explosive chemicals. No, no, no. Go against the norm and go for the chemicals. Yeah. Click on the dangerous chemicals. Chemicals. <laughs> okay, I'll click on the chemicals. Is, is it gonna be a, yeah. what? Oh, oh no, wait, no. no, we chose wait, the majority. What? No, <laughs> we're minor. Really? We're we're majorities. I thought also, we'd be, uh, I thought we'd be in the yeah, that, that, that's the thing. I, I think I think the guy who made this knew that people were gonna choose explosives, so he's trying to lead us towards that one as well. So mm. Maybe oh, should, we let, let's try it. going to the next one. We fell yeah. for it. Yeah, we fell for it. Oh no, such tragedies. Oh, oh uh, geez, no, go back, go back, go back, go back. Go. Would you rather know everything or be the ruler of everything? Know everything. Be the ruler. Yeah, of everything. this is so uh, hard. No, it's not. If you know everything, you're going to be the ruler of everything. Uh, no, no, no. no. They're, 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 we have to pretend that they're mutually exclusive, or else it's oh. not a choice at all. Yeah. Okay. We'll still know everything. I don't want to know everything. Would that be extremely boring? No, it wouldn't. Uh, that's yes, kind of it true. would. If you know everything, you basically you can't <clears throat> discover anything or know anything. Does more. does know everything include just information? Or does it include everything about everyone, about everything? About yeah, it's no yes. everything. So everything means everything, okay? So that... including skills. Yes, all skills in the world. Well, okay, yeah, here, but here's the thing. Here's the thing. Wait, 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 let me let, let, let me let me talk this through. Even if it's even if you can't achieve the skill, if you know everything, you would be able to know how to achieve those skills. Yeah. But how if you're just naturally suckish at it? No, but then you'll know like, if I, you I know, know. I know all the rules to football, but I'm not good at football. No, no. But if you know everything, you could probably know any like theoretical way to improve all. But those you could still be lazy. You could still be lazy. You know, you don't have to do just because you know everything. Uh... I'd no, rather be the rule of everything because knowing everything would be extremely boring, and I'd probably just commit to it yes. the first time. I want to know everything, right? In the long run, yeah, but I also want to rule. I'll probably choose know every knowing everything. <coughs> I yeah. choose knowing. Yeah, okay. knowing everything. No, know everything. Click on that, I guess. Totally Three out of five chose know everything. So, oh, we're actually in the majority. Oh, yeah, of course. 
Because if Cole. you know everything, you would know how to overthrow the government. Oh my, no. Uh, what was that about mute, being mutually exclusive or whatever it was? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, you guys, I, I forgot. Wait, if you know everything, that doesn't mean that people are going to agree with what you have to say. So there could be so many people against you. Yeah, but I if you know everything, so? then you'll be able to know how matter. to convince them. You know them. everything. Well, that's true, that's also true. You don't have to outsmart them and, you know. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Anyways, let's go to the next know, room. Like... Let's go to the next room, would you rather? Okay. When you go... Okay, this one is glitched out. Uh, yeah. It's yeah, not <laughs> that's not, that does not... I don't know what that is. No, neither do I. Okay, um... let's get a good... <laughs> 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 would you rather... <laughs> Wait, <okay>. <laughs> <laughs> Would you rather? Would you, would you rather have a first edition holographic Charizard or get twenty dollars? Since I either you have a Pokemon card or a tw or twenty bucks. How much, can you, how much can you sell that thing for? Let me. Let me Probably more expensive than twenty dollars. Amazon. Yeah, exactly. So I'll, 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 for first edition holographic. First. I'll yeah, it depends one. on how much that can be sold for. Charizard. Uh, that's X and Y, so that can't be. What? That is, okay, for the whole set, it's $7,999. Whoa! Yeah. And you know, for just that, it's $400. Okay, okay. Oh, Charizard, okay. please. Yeah. Give me Charizard. <laughs> Give me Charizard. Charizard. That's not even a question. Oh, we're in the majority. We're in the slight majority. Oh, wow. uh, okay, anyways, next. But the comments imply that it's it's for yourself. Like you, you keep it because it's such a rare thing. But, but whoever created, but That's whoever, but whoever created this doesn't doesn't specify that. So. Okay, this is strange. Would you rather live in a giant peach or live in a giant shoe? But then you'd shoe. be you'd probably be able to get out the peach soon because then the peach would just rot away. Yeah, in Japan. In Japan, yeah. we have this little story about a kid who's in who lives in a peach. Yeah. Yeah. I want to live. Oh, uh, Momotaro. Yeah. What? No. That's not what I was thinking for. I wait. Was it like a book where like there was a boy who like with bugs and like? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Was, like, was it? Was it? Wasn't it by Roald Dahl? I don't remember, yes. but man, that, I remember that giving me nightmares. Anyway, that live in a peach, but still, the movie was. Scary. I, would, I, I would live in a peach because you could just eat the house. Well, then you'll be homeless, but. I, I <laughs> <don't know. laughs> it's a giant peach. It lasts you for life. Okay. And then. <laughs> uh, 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 I'd live in the giant shoe because the yeah, peach would brought out. <laughs> yeah. Either way, it'll stink. also you get bugs. <laughs> oh yeah, I don't like bugs. No, but if you're oh, no, in you the peach, would you get shoe? bugs though? That's the question. Yes, of course. Yes, you yes. Of course. <laughs> it depends on how. A giant shoe can get moldy as well. You know, you don't know. It only gets moldy if you if someone wears that how shoe. Does, how does how does that shoe? Is in America and all the fire ants come. Uh, oh come no! Okay. How about that? Okay, oh, so which people... group consensus? Peach. Shoe. shoe. Let's do shoe. Okay. No. I'm in shoe. Okay. Only thirty-three percent of people agree with You're kidding. But why? Because peaches. Read it's the comments. All, yeah, it's all sticky. So it's a peach. Okay, I'm gonna. I'm. We're looking at. We're looking at the comments right now. Uh, people who uh, chose, they don't want to be bear. sticky. Gear uh, no, cho cho choose. Uh, read the read the blue comments. Read the blue comments. Then you can see. You wouldn't be free. You would be. Oh, free. that's a Dobby joke, isn't it? Maybe. Oh, I don't know. maybe. Let's let's go into the next one. Would you rather only be able to mal, let yet live nine lives? Mao or meow, 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 meow. cat, or be able to talk and live once. Talk and so, live once, or be basically be a human. Talk and live once. I would prefer to be a human. Would you rather be a freak or a human? Talk and live once. <laughs> yeah, you, human. Human. Hmm. I mean, it would suck to live nine lives. You know, oh yeah, um, yeah, that's true. That's honestly. true. Yeah. Especially if you can remember you, each of your lives. And, and also, and, also, and I, have you I have a question. I have a question. I have a question. If you get crushed in one of your lives, does that mean you would just, like automatically respawn and just like waste one life at the spawn, and then you'll just like waste <laughs> all of it right there? 
<laughs> oh, like, yeah, like, if you fall in lava, you'll always just die. Yeah, so, like, you're, like, your nine lives just, like, whoop, gone. That's like, that's like, you, that's like staying home I in, uh, think, Minecraft I, at, at, at lava, in lava. Exactly. So I, every time you die. I think that it's more, like, reincarnation kind of thing. Huh. Mm. Yeah, but you know, but like the, thing, the thing is that reincarnation, you don't remember your past. Well, we no, 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 no but like past reincarnation past. with remembering your past. But then that was the, well, living nine times would still suck. suck balls. Yeah, either way, it'd be terrible. Yeah, so, I would rather talk be a human. Once. And we're not even we're not even talking about the fact where you can't even talk. <laughs> is the other option. Oh yeah, we're, not, we're, we're just saying that living a long time would part. be terrible. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Yeah, uh, we are the majority. 73% of us. Okay. Oh, 73% of people. Uh, would you rather live to be 120 and accomplish nothing notable, or live to be 50 and be well-known for world-changing accomplishments? Uh, it's 120 because it's, I'm probably not going to be having that world-changing accomplishment anyway, so... No, no, no. This guarantees oh, no. that you have well, uh, world-changing accomplishments. Huh. What is the common say? 120. Uh, the comments say, I think living to be 120 is notable enough. Exactly. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's a world record on its own. No, no, but then the question is, would you die the instant you reach 120? You would yeah. die the instant you reach 50, too. So true. I'd <laughs> rather be well known for world changing accomplishments. And live to be 50. Yeah, I'd probably go for the latter too, I guess. Yeah. It, it is a guarantee. Yeah, I'm guaranteed that I'll do something good in my life. How about, like live how, how about you, Riven? You haven't talked for a while, if you like. Hmm? Exactly. Oh, I was just looking at Abraham Lincoln. Did you know he's 193 <laughs> centimeters tall? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Why were you so why, irrelevant? Why were you looking so at Abraham Because <laughs> <laughs> I know he was. <laughs> it, it's as if you're not even interested in this podcast. He probably oh. isn't. No, I know that um <laughs> he's well sorry. known for what he for what he's done, but I know he was um We're killed not before talking he about Abraham Lincoln. Yeah, wait, 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 so, he was, um, he lived to be age 56, but he still accomplished a lot. That, that's know. not 50. Well, yeah, that, that's where and the actually, whole height thing. In those six years, yeah. he accomplished more than he accomplished in his whole life. Yeah. And, uh, that's when the whole height thing came in mind that I started researching about that. Oh my god. So, <laughs> that's cool. That's completely so, irrelevant. So, I think the consensus is live to be 120. What? Uh, group consensus. Yeah, 120 is fine. Yeah. Wait, wait, I have a question. Oh, wow. I have a question. Only 22% well, of people agree with the... Wait, does that, does that, does that, does that mean, does that mean you're basically immortal until you die at 50? Or once... once oh, wait, how about if you... No, you're guaranteed 120. Oh, so that means you could, you could try to kill yourself, but you would still be alive. I don't know. Okay, would you rather have your fingers become hot dogs forever? Or have your tears be relatively acidic. Uh, so does that mean your your fingers will just grow back, grow back, and like you get more hot dogs? Guess oh, what? I don't, I don't, I don't cry because I'm a man. I don't cry, so I'd rather have my tears be relatively acidic. Yeah, I think tears be relatively acidic is. Better. Yeah, I'd probably go for tears. Yeah. I mean, it's even if I cry, I can put them in a little. But tears are coating your eyes at all times. You know, most of these first comments convinced me to take a certain um, direction. Yeah. yeah. Wait, wait, this wait, one wait. doesn't gonna, really give me a... Wait, I'm going to read the first comment. I'm I think saying. I'm... We're fine. We don't have to go into Hot that. Hot dogs for fingers? I think I'm fine. Okay. <laughs> I think oh, I good. just have my tears be relatively acidic. Let's That's just go with that. Because people couldn't tell if they were acidic. Okay. We have like so many one-sided fun. stuff. Give us an actual challenging one to decide. Maybe that'd be our yeah. last one. Like the. Uh, this is no. Uh, no. 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 no that's just a console war. Go to something interesting. Oh, <gasps> Groundhog Day is amazing. Sorry, but you can oh. go back. Oh. Okay. No. Oh, would you rather non-stop pee for the rest of your life or non-stop cry for the rest of your life? 
Non-stop crying. That's non- my tears were set. Non- non-stop crying. <laughs> non-stop crying because yeah, I could I could crying. actually go outside doing that. Yeah. Non-stop, <laughs> non-stop peeing would suck, but I feel like I want to do that. And then you. I'll... Oh wait! <laughs> Read the first comment. Jazz hands from five years ago. <laughs> Sorry, up peeing come. would feel amazing, and it wouldn't be annoying to myself at all. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh god! <laughs> so can we carry on non-stop peeing or non-stop crying? With crying. Like <laughs> <laughs> really, not that big of a difference. Yeah, yeah, it's only twenty percent. Forty to sixty percent. Mm-hmm. We just did that. Are we, did you, oh. Uh. Oh no. No. Nope. Uh. Uh. Would you rather be a famous homosexual professional athlete? Or be a heterosexual average person. Um, I'd probably go for um heterosexual because I don't like sports that much. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not a very athletic person. I think we I, all mean, know the I, I like sports. sports is... It's just that I would prefer to have uh a woman, uh, you know, uh a um a, a, a okay sign with a finger going in that. Okay. But I prefer that. So no, no, I would go for the latter half. Okay, thanks. Thank you for your input. <laughs> okay, so be a heterosexual average person. We should probably just like go for one one last big one. So, oh, someone just left. Okay, one last big one. Oh, there goes Incognito. What? No, oh, he comes back. I just got kicked for some reason. Mm. Okay, um, would you rather not be able to wear clothes or not be able to speak? This is our last one. Oh my god, that's Okay. So... Um, <clears throat> not be able to speak. Why? Because if you're not able to wear clothes, you'd be arrested anywhere. Except for your own house. Except for your own house. But if you're not able to speak, mm. then you can still write stuff down. Yeah, you can be like Stephen, true, can be like Stephen Hawkins. You can have your own like. I, honestly, machine. the the first comments are so good. <laughs> That's probably why they're our first comment. That thing is from four years ago. <laughs> I choose not be able to speak, but I like debating. But at least I can keep my dignity. Yeah, I'd rather speak not, because I could act, I could and, I could write could stuff like, down. You could be like Stephen Hawkins. You could have your own machine. For people like, would people would admi- admire you more if you're dumb. So, hey, can that be our okay. outro? Like the 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 co- the first comment of this one. Can it just, can that just be our outro? <laughs> no, I'm okay. 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 So I think that's all the time we have for today. Join us next time as we discuss the inner workings of the known universe from the perspective of a sixteenth being. I'm joking. And thank oh, you for wait, joining us. That out. Thank you for please joining. Thank you for joining. Bye bye. Thank you for joining us. <laughs> oh and remember, God. resistance is futile. What? <laughs>